Swift but painful oh! End. Oh gosh! <gasps> no! Okay. Okay, uh, let me... Okay. You will fall to our bleeds! They're barbecued! Damn you! Are you guys okay? Fine, you got it. Who are you? All right, that one's gone. I'll take care of them. Um, I'm healing. Okay. All right, back to sneaking. There was really no way to sneak around that. They kind of just all came at us. Why am I whispering? I think we killed them all. I'm not sure if we did though. We should probably just go carefully. Yeah, Miko, I agree. It's like a little Fulmer village. That's insane. I didn't think that they had this. All the Falmer that we've seen in the past in Duomer Ruins have been more like camping where we've seen them. We've never really like uh, seen them, seen them in their homes, you know? I'm going to pick two doors. Go this way. Because remember, we came across that other thing really long ago. That turns into one of those things they pop out of there sometimes. So maybe if we go this way, sneak around, it's not gonna pop up. Nope, nope. I can nope. hear water rushing through these pipes. Same. We must be beneath a lake. Okay, what does that have to do? Why would they do that? To bring water to all the different spots? Does that mean that the Dwemer used water? The or... I heard something. Oh, you heard me getting shot. That's what you heard. Okay. I, I, you got it? Kaiden? Can you murder him for me? I just don't want to die kind of thing. Thank you. Okay. There's something moving down there. We're gonna have to kill it, I think, because I don't see another way down. We gotta go straight through. I hate those things. Kaiden, listen, I still have nightmares from the last time we dealt with one of those. I am not gonna lie, I can take the glowing mushroom. I still have nightmares about them. If you could just help me kill them quickly, that would be really nice. Cuz times we had to kill them before was more than enough for me. Hi. Yo. I barbecued them. Okay, well, good job, guys. Good job. Did you hear that? No. What is it? Fall to my <gasps> Where did that come from? Oh, no. I don't like it here. Okay. Um, I guess that way. Okay, how far does this little Palmer village go? Okay, there's one right there. I'm gonna try to sneak up on him. I bring no, no, I didn't sneak up on him. Okay, set him on fire though. I'll send you to your rest. Okay. Um, through there, and is that the end of it? You know, honestly. Mer's just got a lot to answer for for a lot of things. But making me walk through this Falmer village so I can kill him? Definitely high up on the list of reasons that I need to yell at him. Wait. This is locked. Falmer don't lock things. This, this has to be actually Dwemer Dwemer. Yeah, I don't know who put stuff in that, but it had some nice amount of septums in it. I'm certain of it. Are you sure? We must prepare ourselves. Okay. This is it. We do this for Gallus and for the guild. Okay. Sure. I'm also going to do it because I don't like Mercer. He's here. And he hasn't seen us yet. Brynjolf, wash the door. Eyelash, nothing's getting by me. Climb down that ledge. See if you can... Carlia, when will you learn you can't get the drop on me? Oh, God. What does he have planned now? Mercer, get down from there. Oh, no. Mercer. Oh, come on. Now what? You're flooding this place? When Brynjolf brought you before me, I could feel a sudden shift in the wind. And at that moment, I knew it would end with one of us at the end of a blade. 
Listen, Mercer, just give me the key and then I'll kill you. How about that? You can either give me the key first and then I'll kill you quicker, or you can not give me the key and I'll make it really hurt. What's Carlyle been filling your head with? Tales of thieves with honor? Oaths ripe with falsehoods and broken promises? Nocturnal doesn't care about you, the key, or anything having to do with the guild. Listen, it's not about Nocturnal. It's not about any of that. This, this between you and me right now is 100% personal. Revenge, is it? Basically. Have you learned nothing from your time with us? When will you open your eyes and realize how little my actions differ from yours? Both of us lie, cheat, and steal to further our own end. Fair, but the difference is I have honor and I don't stab people in the back, which is what you did to me, and honestly, I can't forgive that. Plus, you've just been nothing but cranky and rude to me since I met you. It's clear you'll never see the skeleton key as I do, as an instrument of limitless wealth. Instead, you've chosen to fall over your own foolish code. Listen, if anyone's gonna fall right now, it's going to be you. And I'm gonna enjoy it. I've been daydreaming about this for a while now. Then the die is cast, and once again, my blade will taste Nightingale blood. Carlia, I'll deal with you after I rid myself of your death of companions. Where, where'd you go? In the meantime, perhaps you and Brynjolf should get better There outrated. you are. You're not very good at that, Mercer. I can't stop myself. You can't what? Fight it, Bruno. He's taking control of you. I'm sorry. Why can't I use my oh, dragon shout? I can't. Brynjolf, what are you doing? Oh, the two of you. Okay, I'll kill him quick, I promise. Where did he go? Oh, come on. What is happening? Mercer? Mer I've killed legions <sighs> like you. Have you really? <laughs> There you go. There's my dragon show. Enjoy being on fire and dead. Okay, getting the skeleton key. Uh, he also had arrows. Uh, I'm going to take those. Oh, I'm going to take this. I'm going to take all this. Carly, I know you said stuff, but I'm taking all of it because he, he had both eyes. Okay, good. Skeleton key. Oh, that dagger's kind of cool. Okay. Also, probably should take that. Okay, and these. I and let's get out of here. Did done. No luck there, lass. Something must have fallen on the other side of the door because it isn't moving. Okay. We have to find another way out of here before the place fills with water. Okay, kind of too late because it's already filling with water. How do we get out? Oh no, it's gonna be up to me, isn't it? Uh, something up here. All uh, right. Are we gonna have to wait? What is that? Are we gonna have to wait for this place to flood? Hey, I found it. I found it. You guys swimming behind? I hope they're swimming behind me. I found it. Okay. Oh, that was lucky. I think some rocks fell. I'm gonna keep moving. Hope they follow. Guys? Okay. Oh, okay, they made it. That was fun. My toe. Okay. Hi. How did you guys? How did everybody? Sorry, lass. I've got important things. If you'd asked, do. I'd have moved. Speak another time. Okay. Yeah. Um. Hi. Okay. You guys are all just here after I dealt with all of that. Okay. Good. Thanks for keeping everybody safe, Lucian. All right. So what happens now? Sorry, lass. I've got important things I to do. I can't believe it's we'll over. Speak another time. Twenty-five years in exile, and just like that. It's done. I know. All that remains is to ensure the safe return of the skeleton key. Yeah, uh, sounds like that'll be a simple enough task, right? Just return it? I'm afraid it's not that simple. What do you mean? When the skeleton key was stolen from the Twilight Sepulchre, our access to the Inner Sanctum was removed. The only way to bring it back will be through the Pilgrim's Path. The what? Um... Okay, I take it you've never once used it? It wasn't created for the Nightingales. It was created to test those who wish to serve Nocturnal in other ways. Other ways? As a consequence, I have no knowledge of what you'll be facing. Me? Um, I, I guess I thought the three of us were going to go together. No, we should get started then, huh? Brynjolf is needed back at the Thieves' Guild to keep right. order while you're away. That works. And I... 
I can't bear to face Nocturnal after my failure to protect the key. I'm afraid you'll have to face the end of your journey alone. But I... Fine. I'll go return the key to Nocturnal. Tell her you're sorry and that you said hi and, and all that good stuff and then I'll meet you guys back at the guild? Take this with you. I'm not certain if it will help within the walls of the sepulchre, but I certainly don't need it as much as you. I've had this bow almost my entire life, and it's never let me down. I hope it brings you the same luck. Thanks, Carlia. I appreciate that a lot, actually. All right. I get it, though. You can't do it. You can't meet her head on. Good luck. Hey, you want to talk? Sorry, lass. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. Okay, I'll talk to you with the guild then. Carly, is there anything else you want to go over? Yes, fellow Nightingale. All right, looks like we have a uh, sanctum to go break into. Okay, in fairness, where did this bring us? All right, is that Clive? Clive's doing... Uh, he's... Clive... <sighs> Lucy and Clive is trying to fight two wolves. I almost feel bad for the wolves at this point. Okay, let's go help Clive. But honestly, it's not like we're going to break into the sanctum. It's more like we're going to visit and say hi and, and return something to them, which is noble, right? Super noble. I don't know what's chasing behind us. It sounds like it could be a bear, but I wanted to go save Clive first. I didn't need to save Clive. Apparently, Clive can handle Clive's self. It's what I thought. Like I said, you know, worse for the wolves. How you doing? You want to talk? You never talk to me, but yet you seem to talk to Lucian. Why? Why is that, Clive? Okay. He's not going to tell me. Oh, wow. I see how it is. Okay, let's go find the inner sanctum, walk the pilgrim's path to get there, return this key, and then pretend that I'm not now head of the Thieves' Guild. How's that sound? So I think the place that we have to drop everything off is just ahead. Is it that weird tower up there that looks like, well, nobody lives there? Haven't we been here before? I feel like we were here long, long ago, but I could be wrong. We've been to so many places and I continually get lost. No, they look like they want to murder us. So I think uh, we might be in the wrong area. Let's keep going this way then. Lightning. Isn't this the area I had to chase you down in? Huh. So you were, what, just hanging out here and you were hoping I'd find you once I got to this portion of something? I don't buy it. What were you doing hanging out here of all places? Granted, it is pretty and there's plenty of forest for you. Just don't think you get to move back here or something like that. Okay. Um, guys. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Bad, bad bandits. Bad bandits. What do you think you're doing? Oh, hold on. Just take this. There's be have some fire. I, I, he he does. He does now he's dead. Oh no. Too bad. You're trying to kill me. Oh wait, that wasn't you. Done. Everybody dead? Okay. Hi! Who were they trying to kill? Uh okay. It looks like that had the dark elf blood that conjurer so i guess we can go back and see the crazy guy now do i oh, have to i did miss the picturesque didn't i a good thing i have you around to remind me to appreciate the beautiful well i mean all in a day's work right that that's just that's what i do remind you of all the things hi miko honey how you doing sweetie uh, Bandit, he had a lockpick. I took it. Not giving it back. I can't quite believe we're bringing harvested blood to the mad disciple of a Daedric prince. I know. I Whatever's know. in that lockbox had better be worth it. Listen, I don't want to do it any more than the rest of you do, but I feel like we should. Don't ask me why, but I kind of sort of do. Okay, another highway bandit. Uh, do I need the arrows? No, but I took it anyways. All right, let's keep moving then. Wrong horse. There you are. All right, lightning. Let's see. Where did you hang out while you weren't with me? Did you come down here and chill? 
Is there something I need to... Whoa, what is this? <gasps> is that... No, is that just regular rock? Yeah, unfortunately. Remind you of anyone? What? Does what remind me of who? What are you saying, Lucian, back there? I'm just trying to see if there are any ore. No? Come on. I need fossils. This, I think, is where we need to be. Boy, oh boy, am I not excited. Okay, jump over. Um, so... How much do we really need to go back and do this? Because it looks scary in there. I'm not gonna lie. This looks terrifying. Fine, I'll go in. Okay. So, creepy cave. Oh, no. No, no, no. No. Creepy ghost in a big old cave. Okay. I suppose I should talk to him. Maybe he has something nice to say? Maybe he'll say he really likes what I've done with the outfit. Hi. I don't recognize you. Okay. But I sense that you're one of us. Who are you? Avery? Uh, it's nice to meet you. Who are you, though? Because I don't know you. The last of the Nightingale Sentinels. The who? I've defended the Sepulcher alone for what seems like an eternity. Okay. Uh, what happened to the rest of you, then? And why are you a ghost? We were betrayed by one of our own kind. In fact, I'm to blame for what's happened here. Huh? What do you mean? Why are you to blame? Why isn't whoever betrayed you to blame? I was blinded. Blinded by dark treachery masquerading as friendship. Perhaps if I had been more vigilant, then Mercer Frey wouldn't have lured me to my fate and stolen the skeleton key. Wait. Gallus? You're Gallus. Carlia's Gallus? The one that I've... Oh, it's so nice to meet you. I've heard so much about you. I haven't heard that name in a long time. How do you know of me? Uh, it's a it's a really long story. There was the whole like Mercer Frey thing and then Carlia and then I had to become a nightingale. I'm still not 100% okay with that. And then it just listen, when this is over, we we could just go and sit and I'll literally give you the whole story. But I have the key that you're looking for. The key? Yeah. You have the skeleton key. I do. I never thought I'd see it again. And Mercer Frey? Uh, dead. Very, very dead. Then it's over. It is. And my death wasn't in vain. Not at all. Not at all. I owe you a great deal, Nightingale. Honestly, you, you don't owe me anything. I did it for the guild more than anything. I mean... They were really, really in a bad place, and I figured I'd help them out. So, listen, I did it for that. Don't worry about it. You've done the guild a great deal. I hope so. And although they may not show it, I'm certain they appreciate your sacrifices. Yeah, I wouldn't know. I wouldn't, I wouldn't go that far. My regret is that you had to undertake this task alone. Huh? Um, well, not alone. Like, I mean, I don't know what's going to happen going forward, but Carlia helped me up to this point. Carlia? She's still alive? She is. She is. I feared she'd befallen the same fate, mm -mm. ending up a victim of Mercer's betrayal. Nah, she didn't. Don't worry about that. She, uh, is she says hello? She sends her best, I think. More than likely. Um, take this key, write all the wrongs that happened, and we'll call it a day, and I'll get back to being me. Nothing would bring me more pride than to return the key. But I'm afraid it's impossible. Huh? From the moment I arrived here, I felt myself, well, dying. Uh, you're a ghost. How can you die? You're dead. Isn't that the definition of what you are? The sepulcher isn't merely a temple or a vault to house the key. Within these walls is the ebon air. A conduit to Nocturnal's realm of Everglow. Okay. When Mercer stole the key, that conduit closed, severely limiting our ties to her. So I have to do this part all by myself then? I'm afraid so. 
I'm weakening, and I can feel myself slipping away. The years without restoration of my power have taken their toll. Whatever damage has been caused can only be corrected by following the pilgrim's path to the Ebon Man and replacing the key. I was afraid you were going to say that. Really, really afraid you were going to say that. Uh, how does the Ebon Mirror affect all of us, though? The Ebon Mirror is a conduit through which nocturnal influences our world. Not through magic or blessings, but purely through luck. All right. But I don't necessarily believe in it kind of thing. What we do involves skill. Like, sure, I guess you could say occasionally we get quote unquote lucky, but what we do as thieves is dependent on our skills. Not that I'm a thief or anything like that. But seriously, it's dependent on your skill. How fast can you pick a lock? How aware of you of your surroundings? Do you know what the right target is? Stuff like that. That's skill based, not luck. Yes, absolutely. Your skill is your own. Don't let anyone ever tell you otherwise. Thank you. But Nocturnal, she influences our luck. Nearly imperceptible assistance we get when we ply our trade. So, how's that changing the way that things are exactly? Think about the guild. Okay. About the state it was in when you began. Okay. Think about all the little things you might have heard. A pick breaking when it shouldn't have. The clouds in the nighttime sky clearing at the wrong moment. Our access to those bits of luck are what separates us from common bandits. So the Ebimir is closed, our luck runs dry. The lockpick breaks when it shouldn't, the clouds part when they shouldn't, kind of thing? Precisely. There are a few who still call nocturnal Lady Luck, and for good reason. Okay, still sounds like superstitious nonsense to me, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. I'll, uh, I'll handle it. What's wrong with the other Nightingale Sentinels, though? Why are you the only one? With the Ebonmere closed, and their sudden severance from the realm of Everglow, I fear they've undergone a drastic change. They're shadows of their former selves. They no longer remember their true purpose or their original identities. Oh no, why aren't you like them then? My spirit didn't manifest itself in the sepulchre immediately. So fortunately I wasn't present when the Ebon Mirror was sealed. That would make sense. However, ever since that day, I've felt my power waning, slowly draining away. Okay, cool. And you just can't take the key from me, right? Just to confirm. Whatever is affecting the Nightingale Sentinels is starting to affect me, too. Okay. As I get closer to the Ebonmere, I begin to feel myself slipping away. You mentioned that. Even right this moment. I feel strange when I don't think I should be feeling anything at all. I mean, ghosts feeling strange is probably not the best thing, so yeah, I could definitely see that. And what am I going to face on the pilgrim's path? Should I be prepared or do you want to surprise me? I wish I could help you, but I've been a prisoner in this very chamber for the last quarter century. Oh, that's a long time. The only possible help I've come across are the remains of some poor fellow who is trying to follow in your footsteps. Perhaps his journal can help? I guess I'm gonna go read it then. All right, thank you. Good luck, Nightingale. Thanks, Gallus, you too. Try not to slip away while I'm doing this. Oh, so you're gonna do this with me? All right, let's do it together then. 